Hello again, it's Krolo and today in this video I'm gonna show you how you can make this fucking well work since nobody, ah sadly nobody was able to work in this the easiest one. Uh, by far I have tried to do as much as I can to make it easier for you to set up it for the first time. So what you have to do is that. Come to my Discord server, link is in the description, download the verse and download this folder. This folder will come like that. Let's show you. It will come like that. This is uh, the devices that you will need to link in the first class device. And this is the folder, all your assets. So please, please, uh, many people does not know what is a Fortnite project folder. They just look at the US and they try to import them in UFN. That's not possible. So this folder is named PowerWell Asset. Control C or right click, copy. Go to document, Fortnite projects, choose any project you have, plugins, click on that. In the content, please, in content, control V or right click, past. Close the UFN, reopen it again. Then open this folder again, willpower, select all by control A. Control C to copy or right click, copy, go to the viewport of your Fortnite and then Control V or right click or come to edit and past here. Once you have done that, you will get those devices, all of them here. Those are needed to fill the verse of the power. Before that, we will need to test it and see if it works or not. So let me claim. Majority says that it doesn't stop uh, spinning. Now we have super jump. Let's try again. It does work and it gives us a freeze gun. So the, the, the will work. And how to uh, drop the will, I'm going to show you how. All what you need is to open the folder of the power well assets. It should be again in the content folder. So this is it here. We need to go to model and we need to grab uh, this static mesh and this blueprint. Grab them together. Make them up a little bit. And you're good. Do not rotate this. Do not rotate it. Do not move it. If you want to move it, move it with that. Whatever you want. That's it. Now we're good. Of course, you will need to drop that. And you need to drop that. I'm not going to talk about that. You will need to make that as a cinematic. Later on, you need to... You know, everyone knows how to do that. So I'm not going to talk about that. Since there is a button, then we need to go to the get a new verse. So we're gonna fill it together. I believe it's this one. Yes, it's this one. In the general settings, we need the price. Let's say the price is gonna be 50 gold. Good. Now, grant audio. I give you those devices. This is the audio here. Just come here and do whatever sounds you want. So you're going to select that gold checker, select that not enough message that XP granter, select accolade default class. You select this one and uh, remove aura. You select this one uh, player spawners. You know you how many player spawners you have. And remove power, one button. It's a button that you will add right here in the files. So power assets, model, there should be like a button. You can use that as a button in a mesh. However, that's not important. Now we need the spinner. One, we, you can use two, but let's say it's a um, three for all up. A spinner is we select this it's a blueprint we can select it 
don't use the fucking static mesh because you cannot select it it's gonna say that it is incompatible or something like that. you cannot select a static mesh so we finish with that and then we need the wheel button as i told you you're gonna use a button that's how you can do it i, I would show everything as much as i can because uh, we do not want to re repeat that again. So that's a button of interact one. Uh, one custom mesh. And uh, select that and that. that's our button that we're gonna select. And let's go here and select it. Well, cinematic that's like if you wanted the button to move or now you can do that with the using the transform and the spare audio that doesn't matter let's go now and set up the powers so the first power is the double damage you don't need actually anything i already gave you every every device you just need to keep selecting here is your damage amplifier here is, here is your pop-up device by the way when you get those message hards those are mine so you will need to come here in the hard widget click again and search damage and re-add that you will need to do that for this and for the uh, uh, vfx uh, power up so click here and search for double damage aura then re-add it again because it's uh, from mine and then add the class selector and add the aura for that next is gonna be a speed so for speed we're gonna use uh, the regular one then the speed then the uh, pop-up uh, no my bad my bad my bad my bad so we're gonna use this one for speed uh it's my thing so that's yeah good so in speed power that is the regular one that is when he activated the power then aura we can go for double jump so for jump modulator this one pop up etc same for regeneration have a class have a pop up that. and same for shield boost so you need pop up and you need aura you need the amount of shield you want i usually go for one same for vampirism uh, make sure on all those hard message devices you click and then you re-add the, the widget a uh, blueprint then for invisible same card detector uh card granting a pop-up card remove and the aura instant reload we also need a card selector pop-up device freeze gun the same card detector a card granter then the pop-up over and the tracker and for in venomed same pop up uh, uh, power up aura pop up yes ladies and gentlemen you have finished good job